Hello, hello, dear viewers. A very warm welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to have a look at how to tell if we have bad engine knock sensor. The knock sensor is an engine sensor that detects abnormal combustion. The term knock can be ascribed to detonation, pinching, spark knock, or pinking. Knocking sounds are produced when the piston hit a hot spot in the combustion chamber and cause an uncontrolled burn. In other words, it is not controlled by the normal sequence of events during combustion. It has been proposed that uncontrolled ignition causes damage to the engine over time and eventually lead to its failure. The NOx sensor uses an internal piezoelectric element to detect abnormal combustion. Piezoelectricity is electricity resulting from pressure on certain types of materials such as quartz and certain types of ceramic material. The NOx sensor creates an alternating current signal that gets sent to the engine's computer when the engine control mode spark knock, it will retard ignition timing until the knock is gone. The knock sensor is typically screwed into the engine block. In this video, we will look at two different types of knock sensor mounting. One is mounted on the cylinder head. The first videos illustrate a knock sensor mounted on a cylinder head. In the later video, we will see a knock sensor that is screwed on the engine block. When the sensor detects any high frequency engine vibration or knocking, it sends a voltage signal to the electronic control unit and then the electronic control unit retards the spark plug timing after receiving the voltage signal. As a result, knock sensor can reduce fuel consumption, it will help improve fuel economy and help increase torque. Knock sensor failure can easily cause one or more noticeable symptoms. Let's have a look at some of the top symptoms that indicate we have a bad engine knock sensor. 1. Illuminated check engine light. One of the first symptoms and the most common sign of a bad knock sensor is an illuminated check engine light. When the engine control module detects a faulty knock sensor or circuit, it will turn the check engine light and trigger a related diagnostic trouble code. You should always take this early warning sign seriously and have your vehicle inspected before the problem gets worse. P0325, P0327, P0332 are common trouble codes for knock sensor malfunction. Sometimes, using cheap Gasoline causes detonation and triggers the engine control module to wrongly diagnose the knock sensor and send a false malfunction message via a check engine light. 2. Pinging noise from the engine. In case of a knock sensor failure, the electronic control unit may not be able to recognize or fix the spark knock. The failed sensor can result in a metallic pinging noise from the engine. You will also notice that the noise gets more prominent when the engine is under a heavy load. When the knock sensor starts to malfunction, you will hear loud noises coming from the engine that almost resemble stumping sound. This sound occurs within the cylinder walls due to the timing of the ignition of the air-fuel mixture. The longer you go out without fixing this problem, the louder these sounds are going to get. Engine knocking or pinging is fatal to your engine, as it can cause serious damage within seconds, so it is definitely something that you want to avoid. Three bad engine performance. A malfunctioning knock sensor can cause the electronic control unit to wrongly diagnose and adjust ignition timing, resulting in inadequate engine performance. The engine may not feel right while driving at high speed or when the vehicle is carrying a light or heavy load. The worst symptom from a bad knock sensor will occur when the internal engine components become damaged. If you have let this problem escalate without replacing a faulty knock sensor, then your vehicle will begin to increasingly drag and jerk around. There may even be burning smell coming out of the engine and getting into the cabin of your vehicle. Any further use of the vehicle in this condition could result in entire engine being destroyed. Then you are looking at many thousands of dollars to replace your entire engine. Don't wait for that to happen. It is much cheaper to just replace the knock sensor. 4. Poor acceleration. An obvious sign of a bad car knock sensor is a loss of acceleration. This typically happens when you are trying to reach highway speeds. It may also hesitate, jerk or even feel like it is dragging. When you step on the gas pedal to accelerate your vehicle and it doesn't accelerate fast, then bad knock sensor is probably preventing the acceleration from being effective. As soon as your knock sensor starts going bad, you are going to notice a decrease in acceleration. This occurs as the engine default to reduce output to prevent any potential engine damage. If the knock sensor goes faulty, it will no longer aid the ECU resulting in low engine performance. Therefore, the car will suffer from poor acceleration. Because the pressure generated in the combustion chamber is just part of an engine capacity, 
the torque is lower and your car will have acceleration issues. Poor acceleration is a common symptom of bad knock sensor. The power will be much more lower and overall drivability will suffer, especially in low gear. If you feel some stuttering upon acceleration and it is not as smooth as it once was, it could be your knock sensor. 5. Power loss. Once the engine control unit realizes that the knock sensor isn't working properly, your car most likely will lose power. The amount of lost power will depend on the octane limit of the engine and how heavily it depends on the knock sensor input. If your vehicle has a faulty knock sensor, it won't only affect how quickly it accelerates, but it will also lose its stop speed and torque. That's because those default values that your engine reverts to reduce your engine performance. 6. Bad fuel economy. If you notice that you are getting fewer miles per gallon than you normally do, then a bad knock sensor could be contributing to that. Typically, any problem that involves combustion or ignition is going to result in bad fuel economy. That's because the car tends to try to make up for the difference in combustion issue by adding more fuel. If the knock sensor goes bad, then you suddenly start to get very poor gas mileage. This is because your car computer notices a faulty sensor and will then make your ignition run less efficient by changing the timing. Any time that your engine defaults to a default value, you are not getting optimized performance. Not only does that affect power and acceleration, but it also affects fuel economy. The fuel economy reduction isn't likely to be super noticeable, but you will probably see a drop by a few miles per gallon. The car knock sensor help in controlling the air by adjusting the timing and that leads to the right amount of fuel being mixed in. When that goes bad, the car's computer automatically just starts pumping fuel through the car to try to keep it running. This will result in increased fuel consumption. 7. Increased Emission Faulty knock sensor can cause another problem, emission. Your engine may run hot with malfunctioning knock sensor and that can produce higher emissions. This means your car could fail emission tests because it will go beyond what is allowable by the Environmental Protection Agency. 8. Catalytic Converter Damage Bad knock sensor can damage your car's catalytic converter catalyst, resulting in elevated hydrocarbon emission. The hydrocarbons from an engine misfire or running poorly will be re released into the atmosphere without burning them completely. Excessive hydrocarbon emission will result in a collapsed catalytic converter. 9. Engine feels old. This symptom is hard to explain because there isn't concrete symptom to describe. It could be the way the car moves or sounds coming from the engine. Sounds can be significant reasons why drivers become concerned about their car and say it doesn't feel right. Noises coming from your engine are clear signs that you could have a malfunctioning knock sensor. Noises will probably be more of a loud thumping noise. It may not sound loud at first but gets louder after you drive for a while. The noises are created by fuel and air igniting improperly inside the cylinder and not reaching the point of combustion. Those are some of the symptoms indicative of an knock sensor problem. The vehicle will often shake or vibrate and misfire when the engine is started. The engine may emit strong exhaust and burning smell due to the detonation in the cylinders. Fuel economy is often affected, causing the vehicle to burn more gas than usual and requiring frequent fuel replenishment. Also, your vehicle may display acceleration problems, such as dragging, hesitation, or jerking from the engine. A lousy knock sensor can cause severe engine damage if not detected and replaced on time. So, if you notice any of the above signs, get professional help as soon as possible. Well, dear viewers, that is all we have for you in this video. If you enjoyed what has been presented, please smash the like button. If you are new here, do consider subscribing and turn on notifications so that you will be the first to get notified whenever we come up with another video. Till then, stay safe.